Hello, my name is Kristen Bailey and I'm a librarian with the Mercer University Libraries. Today, I'm going to show you how to access, browse, and search in our digital music score databases. I'm going to show you how to browse by instrument and library music source and how to search by title or composer in the Music Online Classical Scores Library. To access online scores through the library, we're going to start on the library's homepage and scroll down until we see research guides and tutorials. This will take you to our research guide list, which is alphabetical by subject. I'm going to go down the page until I see music, and then I'm going to click the main music guide here. Our music research guide features academic resource databases multimedia streaming databases, and then our databases for digital scores. The library currently has two databases that offer digital music scores, Library Music Source and Music Online Classical Scores Library. So first, I'm going to go into Library Music Source so that we can browse by instrument. You can see on the left-hand side of the page that there are options like woodwinds, brass, and chamber music um, in this by instruments box. I want to find cello solo scores, so I'm going to select the strings option. I now have five different options to select from within this category, including cello. Once we're on the page for our instrument, we have a few more options, piano accompaniments, cello solos, and cello parts. I'm going to click the link for cello solos. This leads us to a page where we can select cello solo scores by composer with a box at the top where you can browse the available composers. I'm going to click the option here for Haydn. And I think that the Romance from La Reine looks really interesting. Once I've clicked the link for the title, I'll be able to view the digital score and then use this button to download the score's PDF. And so here you see the PDF of the score. Now that we've found a score in Library Music Source, let's go back to the Music Research Guide. I'm now going to show you how to search by composer and by title piece in the Music Online Classical Scores Library. I'm going to select the database from the list. First, I want to find scores composed by Sir John Tavener. In this case, I can just search for Tavener's last name, but if you're searching for a composer that shares a last name or a first name or a middle name with other composers, you may want to include the full name. For example, looking at composer's last name Bach, you may want to include things like Johann Sebastian or Johann Christian to make sure you get the correct composer. Searching for Tavener actually brings back more than 250 results. And you can see this when we get to our results page. You can use the refine your search bar on the left to focus your results on a specific score title, a specific score type, instrument played, genre, and more. I'm going to focus on the vocal score and then I'm going to select a vocal range in just a moment under instrument played. I'm going to expand it out and then I'm actually interested in seeing things so, um, sung by mezzo-sopranos. Once I update my search, this leaves me with only one response. Responsorium in the memory of Anon Lee Silver. I'm going to click this link to see the full score. It may take a couple of moments for the full score to, to show up in the field, but now you should be able to see the full piece um, related to this work. Now, I want to quickly show you how to search for a piece by its title. In this case, I'm going to be searching for Adam Lay Ebounden. When I click the search bar at the top of the page, I can then put in the title of the piece I'm searching for. 
and hit enter. Once I put in my title and hit the button, you'll see that I actually get my results page, which has three different scores. One by Stuart McRae, one by jo Joffrey Burgeon, and one by Joffrey Bush. I'm going to go down and down, I'm going to go and download Stuart McRae's score by clicking on this link, and then by clicking on the little printer right here, the little printer button. This is going to launch um, a message from your browser. And you can come here, so we'll have these options, and then we hit print, and then it'll launch a message from your browser where you can choose to save the document as a PDF. I can now go into my download folder and open the score. And so here's that full score PDF. I'm now going to go back to the library's homepage. If you need any help finding a resource or requesting it through Interlibrary Loan, please feel free to contact us using the information on the Ask a Librarian page. You can reach us by chat, Zoom, email, or by phone. Thank you.